Hey movie nerds, I'm Scott and welcome to our inaugural Star Wars Theories show where we bring you our thoughts and ideas from the galaxy far, far away. We've got big news this week on the future of Star Wars, so strap yourselves in as we make the jump to light speed. Chewie, punch it! fans will know that the excellent Star Wars Rebels is slowly heading towards its series finale, which brings us to the question of what's next for small screen Star Wars. And this week, longtime collecting site yakface.com stumbled across some licensing trademarks which may give us a hint of what's to come. The new registrations are for Star Wars Resistance and are across a number of product ranges including toys, clothing and a variety of electronic devices. So what is Star Wars Resistance? Well it could be anything, a new book, game or comic series, but there's also a pretty good chance it could be for a new TV series, a Rebels replacement if you will. With the word Resistance in the title, this leads us to believe that this could be a new animated series set during the sequel trilogy. I mean, it makes sense. We have the Clone Wars for the prequels, Rebels for the original trilogy, and now a new series built around the plight of the Resistance in their battle against the First Order. And there's a lot of potential here. The canon wipe, which some fans are still shedding tears over, really emptied out these 30 odd years between Return of the Jedi and The Force Awakens, so it seems like a perfect space to build a new series. Or does it? It would be very easy to follow the same path as Rebels, showcasing the early days of this band of resistance fighters, but I seriously doubt Lucasfilm was interested in rehashing the Rebels formula. Also, whilst Rebels has a clear enemy, the period between Return of the Jedi and The Force Awakens really doesn't. I mean, the remains of the Empire falls pretty early on during that period at the Battle of Jakku, and the few remaining loyalists leave the unknown regions of the galaxy to start the First Order, and they stay fairly quiet out there until Starkiller Base shows up and blows everything up. Obviously, Leia and the Republic are aware of the First Order by the time The Force Awakens happened, enough to have created a resistance, but I can't imagine a TV show set around Leia spending three seasons trying to convince a new Senate to not underestimate the First Order would be interesting to anyone but those who live and breathe for the Senate sequences in The Phantom Menace. What would I like to see? I'm thinking something slightly darker than what's come before. More spies and intrigue than people actively fighting. We know that the First Order spends some effort in the 30 years between Return of the Jedi and The Force Awakens, capturing children to undergo the conditioning that populates their Stormtrooper army. So I think it would be kind of neat to see Leia's operatives investigating these disappearances and slowly undercovering the truth behind all the deep dark secrets underway in the unknown regions. So, Star Wars Resistance, will it be the next big thing in Star Wars? We'll just have to wait and see. Let us know what you think in the comments below about what you think Star Wars Resistance could be or what you would like to see from the next animated Star Wars show. So with that, I'm off to Toshi Station to pick up some power converters. See you at the movies, nerds.